What's good YouTube? It's your boy Curtis aka Flex coming to you with another episode of PRs this time doing it with squats Now as you know when I uh, do my uh, PR videos I just try to Guys, give you guys like a update or a breakdown of what my current PRs are. Uh, you know, show you a little bit of my technique on how I go at going towards a new uh, PR record, and then you know, give you a video of showing it. So, check out this uh, video of the me uh, get into my PR, and then uh, I'll finish it off with uh, the end of the video. All right, guys, so as you guys normally should know by now, I always try to start uh, every compound lift with just the bar itself, just to really just test out the movement and just make sure that, uh, or see how I'm feeling that on that day, you know, again, to test out the movement and make sure that, you know, I can handle, know what I can handle going into, you know, lifting. So I always use the bar first, did it for about five set or five reps and then went on to uh, 135 pounds. At 135 pounds, I uh, again was feeling the weight out with a little bit on my back and just making sure I performed the exercise with the best amount of technique that I could possibly do. Uh, as you can see there, I'm starting to feel nice. Uh, the music I was uh, listening to at the time was real good. So again, I went to 225 and I managed to rep that up for another five reps. You know, again, just you don't want to keep your rep range too high because again, you're really, today I went into it knowing that I wanted to try to see if I could uh, hit my PR or beat it. So I went into it with not doing a wider range of uh, uh, a wide amount of reps just to you know keep my stamina going into the heavier lifts. Uh, as you can see here, I'm really trying to feel myself out. I'm listening to my music, jiving a little bit, and then I go into my lift for 315, and I managed to pull off another four reps. Uh, as you can see there, I'm really trying to prep myself up. If you could see on the right side there, I actually forgot to clamp the weights i did that on the left or you can see it's not on the left side either but you could really tell that the weight is really bouncing around which also makes it a little bit harder to uh you know balance yourself and squat properly so as you can see going into my uh 405 which is my previous record i made sure i put the clamps on so there would be no shaking around of the weight or anything etc as you can see i really made sure i put my proper spotting right and I managed to squeeze up squeeze out excuse me uh, one rep with, uh, with a successful uh, lift as you can see coming into the end now here I'm really trying to drive myself up uh, the song that I can't remember exactly the song I was listening to but it really really got me into it as you can see I lifted up first but I wasn't feeling the position of my neck except or, or where my neck goes on the bar so I put it down brought it back out and uh, put myself properly. Squatted down, noticed that I was starting to strain a little bit and uh, I forced myself as fast as I could be as soon as I uh, got back up to bring that stuff back to the bar. So it was a success, excuse me, it was a successful lift and I'm very proud that I uh, pulled off the uh, 425. Hopefully I can get more soon. All right, so as you can see there, that's my, uh, video of me uh, getting up to 425 uh, it took me a little while to get to it but and it was a quite a struggle to actually push the, that amount of weight back up but I managed to do it and so make it back to the uh, the platform to actually put it back down so I consider that a, a great accomplishment hopefully soon I could keep going to higher and higher limits hopefully by let's say mid 2017 I could get to 500 and uh, keep getting more and more PRs because again, as you know, I'm trying to get into the whole powerlifting game and hopefully next year when I do actually hit this first uh, competition, I'll come in just banging some big time weights. So I hope you guys are liking this type of content. If you're liking this type of content, make sure you share it with others 
and you subscribe because the only way I could grow and hopefully other people will get to like my content is by you guys sharing that is watching me already. So please like, comment, subscribe, share my content so again, others can see me as well. And always remember guys, at the end of the day, flex them guns. Bullet.